Hey guys, I've got two awesome vegan recipes for you today. One with tofu, one with tempeh. You're gonna love them. I am here today to talk to you guys about some vegan options. First of all, in the 21 Day Fix, there are four vegan options. So there's tempeh, there's tofu, there's vegan Shakeology, and then any other vegan protein powder counts as a red container as well. I know a lot of you guys are asking me, why don't beans, when you mix them with rice, why does it count as a yellow? The macros are what they are, and rice and beans, when you put them, it's still a high carb meal. So that is why the options are limited, but I am here to help you guys. So the first thing we're gonna start with today is a tofu recipe. Two teaspoons of the coconut oil. We have two red containers of tofu that I'm gonna just add in here. So I'm gonna let that start cooking down and then I'm gonna slice up one red uh, bell pepper and this counts as a green. Okay, so we're gonna put in one green container of the bell pepper and then I'm gonna put in one green container of spinach. This basically is gonna be two reds, two teaspoons, and two greens because it's one serving. Obviously when you eat half of it, save the other half for another meal, but that's what it counts as. But while this starts to cook down, I'm just gonna add the last of the seasoning. We're gonna do Himalayan sea salt to taste. Not a lot, we don't wanna go crazy on the salt. And then hot sauce. How spicy you like it will be how much you add in. All right, so we're just letting this cook down a little bit. Now, if you're vegan, you probably already know how to prepare tofu, but for others who are not and who just wanna try it, just have something new, before you cook your tofu, you always wanna get all the extra water out of it. So just put it on a paper towel, get that extra water out because it's like a sponge, it's gonna absorb. So you want it to absorb your seasoning and if you leave all the water in there, it won't have any room to do that. Guys, the more you cook your food, obviously you do start to cook the nutrients out of it. So we always wanna to try to start with the, the protein and cook that since that usually takes a little bit longer. And then you can add in your peppers, let that cook a little bit, and then usually save your spinach towards the end because that's gonna cook the fastest and we don't wanna cook all those good nutrients out. So this is just about done here. It's basically like a scramble. So I'm gonna turn the heat off. And again, remember, this is two servings. So we don't wanna eat the whole thing all at once. If you do, make sure you're counting it as such. Mm. So good. There it is, you guys. Just a fun way to spice up your tofu and have a fun little new recipe. Simple, quick. Let's move on to the next one, which is a tempeh recipe. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to our tempeh recipe. And we're gonna do tempeh with a little tahini sauce. So the first thing we need is two teaspoons of coconut oil in our pan. One. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut our tempeh into strips. So this is gonna count as two reds and two teaspoons, the whole recipe. So we're just cutting these into little strips. So these are gonna cook about two to three minutes on each side, just so you get them a nice golden brown. Now, while that is cooking, let's make our tahini sauce. So what this is, is basically a sesame seed type paste. You're gonna do two teaspoons of the tahini paste, the juice of half of a lemon. So we're gonna really squeeze that in there. And then it's one to two tablespoons of water, depending on how you like the consistency. I like it a little bit more saucy, so I added closer to two tablespoons of water to this. Now, while this is making, I'm gonna come over here and I just wanna start to season this tempeh a little. So I'm just gonna do a little bit of the Himalayan sea salt on there and a little bit of cumin. And then we're gonna start to flip these over. It's about two to three minutes on each side until you get that nice golden brown. Now, when you're working with tempeh, a lot of recipes call for you to steam it first because it is a little bit harder. This one does not because we want it to be a little bit more crunchy. Okay, so I have one already plated. I'm gonna let those finish cooking down, but here's what it looks like all finished. And again, remember it's two reds and two 
teaspoons. Let's go in and give it a little try. really good. Tempeh is not something I eat on a normal basis, but like I said, you don't have to be vegan to try tofu or tempeh. They are both delicious and fun alternatives. I hope these helped you vegans have a little bit more fun with spicing up your recipes. Thank you for joining me. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!